Okay, so now we're going to make a large batch of our Mediterranean spice blend. We will be multiplying our recipe by seven, which will actually give us 16 small containers to hand out to participants for this particular recipe. So once we multiply that up, we will be using three quarters of a cup plus two tablespoons of dried basil. Sometimes you have to buy multiple containers. It's hard to judge how many cups and tablespoons are in a container, but we will use it the next time we make this spice blend so it won't go to waste. Oregano, same measurement, three quarters of a cup plus two tablespoons. Next up, thyme leaves. Um, for our large batch, it is one quarter of a cup plus three tablespoons. You will notice as you make your spice blends with your participants that a lot of them do use some of the same spices. So you can intermingle um, what you have left over from one container into another recipe to use that up. Onto granulated garlic, one quarter of a cup plus three tablespoons. And finally, our onion powder or granulated onion, and that is going to be one and three quarters teaspoons. So a small amount of onion powder. And there we have our nice Mediterranean blend. We will divide that out and it's going to make 16 small containers. Each container um, should contain about three tablespoons of the blend. Three, three and a half. We have a little left over on this one. Pop our lids on, make sure they're sealed nice and tight so they don't come off when our clients are transporting this home. Right on these with a sharpie and they have some nice Mediterranean spices to take with them that they can use um, for all sorts of applications.